shit often, but there are cases where the suspect might feel like, even though I don't kill you, I want you to be afraid of me. I want you to know how violent I am and I'm capable of absolutely anything. It's an intimidation within itself. I want you to feel the psychological effects of watching people around you die before I come for you. I've witnessed just about a little bit of everything as it relates to voting. Probably be pretty difficult to shock me now, but I've seen a lot of cases when people are killed for some of the most insignificant reasons. And when the motives just don't make sense, hearing behavior is one of the most difficult things to predict. And everybody has different triggers. I have had cases where people are hanging out in a group, having a good time, and something happens and it escalates into violence. Even if we know each other for years, do we really know each other? Just because you spend time with somebody an hour here or a couple hours there, do you really know what's going on inside that person's head? 